I'm Ashley. And I'm Zeta. And welcome, welcome back. back. We're going to show you a little stuff um, our town does to celebrate fall. Um, it's fall, y'all. Today, we're doing um, something beautiful in Logan County, Kentucky. We've got these um, hay bale trail where you go and you see different hay bales have been decorated by people in the community and businesses. And this is the very first one that we're starting out with because it's concept. It's a nice little fall thing to do. It's super cute. I'm excited to see what all they've come up with this year. Yes, they're always different and very cute and coordinated with sometimes where they're at. Like we're at the UK Extension Office, which is why it's got a UK thing. So, and we apologize. Um, we do have the sound up, but it could get um, a lot of the background for the road because a lot of these are next to the road. But anyways, we hope you guys enjoy. We're at our as you can see, County Clark Courthouse. We're yeah. not sure what the theme. Hey, hey, mask. That's oh, it. hey, wear hey, your mask. Wear your mask. Very so clever. So it's a very on point for the times we're living in, I guess. Yeah, but they've got you know they've all got different colors and the different color hair, but they each have their masks on. And so you've got the green guy, the blue guy, the red, and the purple. It's like a strawberry. I wonder what they would do. Oh, it is like a strawberry. It's very cute. <laughs> or Christmassy, depending on what time of year you're, you're looking at. But I do. I get it. It's a play on words. I and can't believe you didn't immediately see it, though. On those signs? Hey, or that they were wearing masks. masks. I saw they were wearing masks. But I didn't really think that was a theme, you know? But I get it now. And so, very good. The all-time best Halloween movie right here, guys. Hocus Pocus. I gotta say, I watched it last year, and I think it's just nostalgia because, because that's what it is. However, the cat, Minx, Minx is like the Binks. little black cat. Binx, Binx is like the little black cat Salem that Ashley and I kind of share. How long. But I want to say they've got the little moles for the girls, which crack me up, and they're painted. But this is the one that Ashley seen pictures of and she was the most excited about going to see. She was like, the Hocus Pocus one. I wish we had our Hocus Pocus t-shirts and stuff. Ah, we didn't think about that. Ah, I didn't bring mine, so there's no like going back to redoing it. But yeah, nothing but a bunch of Hocus Pocus. Which they were talking about remaking, so we'll see. On right. to Auburn now to check out what they've got there. I thought it was a little cat. I don't know if it's a mouse. Maybe it is because it's cute little ears. Yeah. And it's, but it's, look at the tail. Come here. That tail? Maybe, maybe. Yeah. That's a mouse. I think you might be right. <laughs> All right. Let's go to the next one. Okay. So we're still having a bit of debate whether or not this is a cat or a mouse. And, and I. So, wait. I would like you guys to rule in before you hear each of our like ideas about it. So <laughs> go ahead and comment below if you think it's a cat or a mouse. And now we're going to tell you why we think it is what it is. <laughs> While Ashley watches the road. Well, he's like cutting half a face off. You watch the camera then, not the road. <laughs> okay. The reason I think it is a mouse is it has round ears. Everybody knows that cats have pointy ears. And I think that the reason it has round ears is just because maybe they didn't pay attention enough to that part possibly. Or you know, that's just a material that they had in hand. I think it's a cat because it has stripes. I've never ever seen a mouse that has stripes. I think that was just like coloration. It's and not like stripes. it's not like that they had maybe and like a gray with a darker gray or something. They were definitely stripes. So what did you guys think? It was a Bengal tiger, so technically it was a cat, and Jada was right. Oh my gosh, how tall it is? How cute is this one? Oh my gosh. Gets points for like having multiple, so it's got, it's a little peacock, and it's got a, um, it's got corn stalks behind it, like really big corn like stalks. Like the peacock feathers. Yes. Stuff. And then the cute little nose. I'm liking this. I think, is it like an umbrella material? Maybe. I don't know, but. Look at how tall it is, because I mean, we're like 5'8 on. They're like towers over <laughs> me. Yeah, it's very cute. I oh, love it a lot. 
We have other people who are coming to look at it now, so we're gonna skedaddle. I know, so someone has gotten very artsy, a Mr. Tom here, and they have spray painted yeah. um, what looks like a little sheet and covered the wheat. And then if you, nope, I thought that that statue was also a bit like supposed to be festive, but it's no. just a statue. <laughs> they did a really good job. Yeah, I'm not very artsy. it's a very cute owl. Very cute. Are you getting like how townsy our little square is <laughs> over and stuff? So we have Dumbo right here. And can we add that the flowers match, match like your corn Yeah, yeah. It's so cute. The mums. looks really well. I called mums, Jada. Come mums. on. Mums. Sorry. The mums match. I'm really loving the elephant. It's very distinctive. 100% you know what it is. They've done a good job making the like trunk feature. And they've got like a little like fishing wire or something that's holding it up. Does it have a tail? No, but they did spray the rest of the hay grave to make it. No, I think it kind of does. Is that like a little tail? No. Or is it just happens to be there? Happens to be there. It though. looks like a little tail. Check out our Instagram page for a double mint commercial with the elephant. So they put their like hay behind this play, but it still, still definitely counts. You've got it's the, the minions. minions, you know, from Despicable Me. Bing, bing, bing. And they, they say things that you don't understand. And they have the bananas at the bottom too. And the little mouths cut out. Very adorable. Super cute. We are here at our alma mater, Auburn Elementary Middle School. And they have a very big display. Yeah, like, they've got a flock. Which I love. Actually, we're you do a tour, a tour. Yeah, it goes all the way around. All the way around. They've got this. Got the giraffe. And then a monkey. Come on, come on. A monkey. A butterfly. I'm not sure. If it's a, a peacock. I know it's a parrot. A parrot. A peacock. I didn't. I was thinking a peacock from earlier. I meant a parrot. I did. But all the way around here, it says. It takes courage because it's a jungle out there, which I think is why they've got a whole theme, like very clearly yeah. marked out. So, props on Auburn Elementary. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Get in the video. We almost passed this one up. And Jada's like, what is that? So I'm like, I don't even know. Because look from this side, it's just like, Dots very and dots. Long. Very that long. A, that was a lot of spray paint. Yeah. It's a lot of bales of hay. But at first I was like, when I saw the front, I said dragon. And then I said, you idiot. He's got a long body. Snake. <laughs> go, go stick your head up underneath them teeth, Ashley. Ah. <laughs> and look at the eye detail. It's a pumpkin. That's cute. I love it. And the nose, like they've got the PCP piping. Oh my gosh, actually this goes like way back. This is like cardboard that goes back to like here. Like this one took some work, yo. Yeah, it did. They got, they got like the mouth opened all the way up in here. Nope. <laughs> my nose is. <laughs> they weren't playing around with this one. Well, our alma mater, Auburn, are the Tigers. So maybe that's where they drew inspiration for their hay bales. A huge tiger. And then the diner is Black Sheep Diner. So they've got little black sheep. Super cute. Very cute. So they've incorporated their own like restaurant as well as like the city in which they're in. So, and it is, it's like, this is really big. I feel like you guys can't tell all the time, so I'm like using myself as a... I don't know. You got... They used two styles of hay bales. Yeah, they did. Get it done. They're really up in their game this year. Even though COVID's happening, I thought maybe less people would do the hay stuff this year. But I guess but... it's outside and it's something fun. Yeah. So I'm happy that it's been... The tradition's been kept alive. Yes. Ashley and Jada are 